Hello everyone, welcome to our YouTube channel IIPS, the Educational Incubator. I am Sonia Ravas, your host for today. Let's see our topic for today, Microeconomics versus Macroeconomics. This is a subtopic which coming under the entire video series of Introduction to Economics. So you can find the link below, go and click, learn more about our chapter, our videos, Introduction to Economics. Let's see what we have got today. Microeconomics. Microeconomics is defined as a branch of economics which studies how the individual parts or actors of the economy, the households and the firms make decisions to allocate limited resources. We know economics is the study, the social science, which study the behavior of the individuals in making their crucial decisions of satisfying their unlimited needs and wants. Microeconomics is a branch of economics. The specialty in here is, in microeconomics, we are giving a little more highlight, much more effort to identify and understand the individual parts behavior. Rather, in an example, you can say, in microeconomics, we are focusing about an individual behavior a household behavior, a firm behavior in a separate manner. When it comes to the macroeconomics, as going with the definition, macroeconomics is a branch of economics which studies the structure, behavior, and the decision-making of the entire economy, which can be national, regional, or rather global economy. In here, what we can see is, in here, Microeconomics, we are focusing about the bigger picture. We are focusing about the aggregation and the accumulation. So we can argue like this, where the collection of microeconomics can be identified as macroeconomics. Collection of microeconomics can be identified as macroeconomics. Let's take this microeconomics and macroeconomics into one page scenario. Both of them are the branches of economics where in microeconomics we study how the individual parts of the economy make economic decisions and in macroeconomics we study how the collection of players of the economy make economic decisions as a whole so in here the economic decisions is thoroughly focusing about the decisions they make in align with the satisfaction of their unlimited needs and wants. Again, coming back to microeconomics, it also identifies how individual demand and supply affect. How the individual demand and supply affect, where on the other side, it identifies how the demand and supply of the entire economy affect. For your more clarification, we have got a little example down there. You can see demand for the rice to be consumed by your household. A demand of a household where on the other side it says macroeconomics example for macroeconomics demand for the rice to be consumed by an entire economy in microeconomics it's a demand for a little household where in macroeconomics it is the demand for the entire economy we have got a little question just to understand your testing let's see the branch of economics that studies the dimensions of individual households and firms is called. So when we get like a question like this, we have got the answers, macroeconomics, microeconomics, positive economics, normative economics, and home economics. You might, you might don't know what you call as positive economics and normative economics and even home economics. But for a fact, I know now you know and you have an idea regarding macroeconomics and microeconomics. Let's see how we can tackle this question with the knowledge we have got. Reading back the question, the branch of economics that studies the dimensions of individual households and firms is called. Dimensions of individual households and firms is called. We can see in the question, they have highlighted the fact dimensions of individual households and firms 
when you find something like that so it's clear cut obvious that this is focusing about the microeconomics concepts as it focus the dimensions of individual households and firms and it is a wrap up for today i hope this video was really helpful for you to have an idea regarding microeconomics versus macroeconomics thank you thanks for watching subscribe us for more informative video like this like share and comment if you have any more issues regarding economics we are more than happy to help you see you once again and thanks for watching